Whew. All right, so we're back again. So after hours later, basically I've had the first set of the uh, APC SMX UPSs installed with the associated battery packs, as you can see here. So one of the things I decided uh, later on was to separate the amount of battery backup uh, for each device because I did a load test using the uh, Brutal Tech dash box and uh, gem or green eye monitor. So I had a real world factual uh, data set as to, you know, what is each device consuming uh, when they're all chained together. So it wasn't simply just while I was guessing, you know, just, you know, I think it's going to be that, I believe it will be this, uh, et cetera, et cetera. It's real world. So I know exactly what the wattage, uh, kilowatts per hour, the volt amps, uh, everything. So I figured after I checked what the real world consumption was in the draw, whether it be startup, RMS, uh, steady state, etc. I said, you know what, I really don't need to have 10 battery packs chained uh, all in a row uh, just for something that consumes 35 watts or, you know, 100 watts, whoever it may be, okay? because this, these packs are intended to support anywhere from 750 to 3,300 watts. So <laughs> I know, I know, uh, having, say, 150, 150 watt uh, draw on a 3,300 watt UPS, it's gonna give you endless uh, run time. So what I decided to do was spread out the uh, extended battery packs and fair share. So in the worst, worst case scenario on the smallest battery pack, uh, the 750 SMX, uh, it would have the same um, kilowatt hours, sorry, um, wattage that it could provide uh, for those devices. So there's some stuff I had to kind of just find a common ground or happy medium because uh, a lot of the high consumption items that I had in the past, they've basically been pulled out of the environment. So there's really uh, very few things that consumes a lot of energy because the, the primary role and primary goal of what I've been trying to do in the last uh, 11 years is to reduce my energy footprint, energy consumption, and hopefully at the end of the year, either be uh, what they call net zero, meaning I generate or consume uh, enough electricity that I break even, meaning I'll have renewable energy, whether it be solar, wind, hydro, etc., that I have enough that electricity that's coming into the building versus what's being consumed that I'll break even, ideally zero, right? Uh, but actually, the ultimate goal is to be actually uh, feeding a plus back into the grid. So I'm getting, you know, uh, residue revenue back from the utility or they give me a credit, whatever it may be. But um, that's pretty much what I've been doing in the last 11 years is to reduce my energy signature, my consumption, to be more green, et cetera, et cetera. Uh, so way back in the day, I had this huge server farms. I had the bill. When you get your bill and it's twelve to $1,800 just for electricity, and that's just to uh, support what's really considered a hobby, okay? It's not something you need to have. I mean, you need to eat. Uh, you need to wash your clothes. You need to take a shower. You need, you know, uh, some of those personal enjoyments. You know, watch TV, whatever. But, I mean, you don't need, you know, 50 servers running 24-7, uh, et cetera, et cetera. Because unless you're doing the whole Bitcoin mining or you have some type of uh, services that you provide to other people. Uh, and, again, this was just more for fun. This is stuff that I just want in my lab, things I wanted to do, trial stuff. You know, things that, you know, either I was weak on or things that I was very familiar, but I want, you know, to be able to do it at home. And, you know, now it's a different time, different period, different phase in my life. I said, I've had it and enjoyed it. It's kind of like, you know, fast women, fast cars. <laughs> well, don't get me wrong. You always enjoy fast cars and fast women. But you know, with anything, it comes with moderation, right? Anyways, uh, I just want to show just a quick update. Uh, a lot of sweat equity went into uh, getting these uh, first set of uh, battery packs and UPSs inside this uh, 600 millimeter uh, server cabinet. And I was sweating balls because I'm doing this all by myself. 
Uh, it'd be great if my girlfriend was around, but she's busy. She's doing other stuff, doing real stuff, enjoying a weekend instead of sitting here like a loser <laughs> and doing what? Putting batteries in a box. Yes, guys, that is the epitome of the uh, IT geek or whoever, you know, that kind of stuff. We all have our uh, uh, fixes. So my hobby is uh, my home. And one of the things is to ensure that anything and everything has enough power during a grid down event, a blip, what have you. So this is the first uh, iteration and the first series of uh, videos I'm going to make. And basically it tracks uh, my efforts to sustain uh, my entire network. So when there's a grid down event, I don't see it. All I know is I get an email, there's a beep, I get the Julie US, I get Alexa, all those things. They basically tell me, hey man, the electricity is out. And then that's it. And I'll carry on uh, watching TV, uh, watching a video, chatting on a forum, uh, sending email, listening to music. It doesn't matter, right? Uh, I'll still be rocking that while it's pitch dark everywhere else uh, in the city. Anyways, this is getting long. I just want to keep this short. Uh, I'll address the next couple of things regarding um, the next steps and how I'm going to iterate because this is a very small sample and subset of what I'm doing because uh, the other stuff that I had uh, in the past where, if you guys want to Google it, it's basically uh, APCs, like huge uh, enterprise, uh, what they call Symmetra, um, UPSs or online uh, backup systems. So I had eight of these refrigerator size uh, <laughs> battery packs, which provided, well, first of all, they're like 100K a piece. I had eight of them. So yeah, uh, it was super awesome. I could power my house for like 30, 60 days uh, nonstop. And I'm talking about like the dryer, the washer, the stove. It didn't matter what it was. They provide the 120, 240 uh, volts. And again, they're meant for like a building. They're meant for an entire uh, server, uh, farm, etc. This is not for your residential consumer, but it didn't matter. I had it and it's great. I have since uh, sold them off because um, the next step in my life is to finally rent it in my basement and I couldn't have eight of these giant refrigerator size uh, UPSs just taking all the space you know don't get me wrong it pained me because I got them in such a great deal they're all brand new um, you know 100k a piece and there's eight of them think about it that's almost a million dollars eight hundred thousand dollars worth of hardware and well I guess I can tell you now it didn't make a difference so I got them for 60k I mean, that's no small number, but you think about it. For less of the price of one, I got eight of them. Brand new, sealed, still in the box, whatever. And I rocked that for about, I don't know, um, a few years. You know, had everything hooked up to the house. And it was fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. Uh, but it was more, you know what? It's one of those things. You you want to play with it. You, you had it. You could say you had it. It was there. Uh, it's, you know, something happened. You know, I never worry. I didn't, there was nothing I had to worry about. My house was powered all the time, you know. So, and that remember that supplements all the other backup and failure systems that were in place. You know, whether it be a generator, uh, the battery packs, and all this stuff. I mean, this these were just this five separate independent systems that were uh, supporting my house, you know. And it's more just to play with, you know. Uh, but now I'm moving on, and I'm trying to downsize and. This is the next uh, step. So hopefully I'll bring you more stuff that has to do with uh, APCs, UPSs. Uh, why I went with certain uh, models, brands, um, units. Because, again, my overall goal is en energy management, energy consumption. And having stuff that is consuming a lot of energy or doesn't give the same value I'm looking for made no sense. Anyways, check you out later.